you, Rob. Our Senate sources confirmed tonight a forced resignation today for a top Ohio Senate staffer because of new allegations of misconduct involving Senate employees. Michael Primo was minority chief of staff for the Senate Democrats, a position he held for two years until he was asked to resign today. And that resignation comes just one month after Republican Senator Cliff Height was asked to resign amid allegations that he sexually harassed a State House employee. Dan Perlman has details tonight on this latest scandal and reaction from both parties. Well, Colleen, the details on this still coming in tonight, but here is what we know so far. Michael Primo is out. The Ohio Senate Minority Chief of Staff resigning from his post to position, as you mentioned, that he's held for the last two years. Both parties responding to what happened through statements. On the Democratic side, Senate Minority Leader Kenny Yuko wrote this. Recently, concerns of inappropriate conduct towards staff came to my attention, and I found the information to be credible. Therefore, at my request, Mike Primo today submitted his resignation as Minority Chief of Staff. Deputy Chief of Staff George Boas has assumed the role of Acting Chief of Staff effective immediately out of respect for those who raised the concerns and wish to maintain their privacy. I am not commenting further. John Fortney, spokesman on the Republican side, wrote, Senator Yuko informed us that he asked for the resignation of his Chief of Staff due to concerns express expressed by subordinate employees about his conduct. While no complaint has been filed, we are working with Senator Yuko and his staff to ensure that all appropriate steps are taken in this matter. So again, details on the specific allegations still being kept quiet at this hour. Of course, we will continue to follow this story and bring you the very latest tomorrow morning on NBC4 Today. Live in the studio, Dan Perlman, NBC4.